Alright, welcome back to another episode here on our WWE SmackDown vs. Raw 2 2006 General Manager Mode. I am, of course, Dominic here on the Bad Wrestling Channel, and, ladies and gentlemen, I said at the end of the last episode, Joy was um, going to have to really prove herself, and um, the, sh the show I have for her, um, <laughs> yeah, she's going she's, she's gonna to have to prove herself. Uh, I'll show you right now. So the first matchup, um, it's gonna, it's gonna actually really show Joy Giovanni. You know, yay! Joy's gonna be on the show for once. Um, a one on three handicap match against uh, Christy Hemi. You know, she's not too, um, she's not too much of a, of a, of a, of a, of a challenge. I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't believe so. Um, uh, Carlito. Um, you know, he can be a pretty cool cat when he wants to be. And, um, D in Davari. In Davari. <laughs> so, when I, when, when I drafted Joy, um... <laughs> I, this is sort of what I had in mind for her. I'm sorry, but look at her, look at her popularity. Like, she might gain popularity for being on the show. Like, you know what? If she wins in both matches that I have planned for her on this episode, like not on this episode of Rob, on this episode of our GM mode, then hell yeah, she can stay. God damn, she can be freaking number one contender. But yeah, I don't see it. <laughs> I don't know, but you never know what happens in the wacky world of WWE. Uh, match two. Okay, we're going to get more serious now. <laughs> okay, submission match. Single. Okay, because apparently submission matches are one of the only matches that you can have female fight females fight in. So Trish uh, versus not Trish, Tori versus Stacy submission match. That's pretty easy. Um, not a women's title match, but just well, you know what? Yeah, sure. Why not? Women's title matchup. It's not gonna do anything. Um, rivalry in place match: Carlito versus Kane. You know, just get that. You know, a little, a little, a little break. Um, you know, single no manager with manager. You know, we gotta get the tag team feud in in the show. So we're gonna have Eddie with Chavo Guerrero. Considering Chavo Guerrero keeps losing, hopefully Eddie can help build up his popularity. Um, versus Rick Flair, woo himself, and Randy Orton. Or with Randy Orton, so there we go. That that works. That works out. Um uh next match. It's going to be a a number one contenders match because Batista, I don't really have any plans for him yet. So, you know, our lat, our, our our intercontinental champion. So we're gonna have a ladder match, triple threat, to decide who will be number one contender for the championship. So we're gonna have Rey Mysterio, this little man. He's quick. He can climb up a ladder if he so wished. Versus the Big Show, who's probably taller than the ladder itself, and Muhammad Hassan because Muhammad Hassan and Big Show pretty much are just in a few. That's kind of the only reason why. He's in that. Um, promo again. Merchandise sponsors it because, of course, we always need money. Um, but while we have the number one contenders match for the IC title, uh, we're going to have the IC title match on the line. That's right. The, uh, the Intercontinental Championship will be on the line here tonight. And the singles tables match. We're going to have Kane. Okay, because, you know, Kane and Carlito, they're in a feud. However, you know, they're not, they're not in a feud right now. Um... Or in this episode. So, you know, Kane is going to potentially be winning the Intercontinental Championship. Potentially. Maybe. I have no idea. We'll see. Um, main events. Uh, to continue the feud between Triple H and, um, and, and, uh, 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 what's, uh, Kurt Angle. You know, to continue that feud. We're going to have a backstage brawl fight. Smackdown extravaganza. Now, I just want to go through my entire roster really quick. Okay, yeah, so everybody's being used on the show. Okay, nobody's not going to be used. And, oof, I have a lot of expensive m matches. Yeah, anyways. So, uh, to go through the card one more, one more time. Joy Giovanni in a, in, a, in a see if you're worthy of being on my show match is what I'm going to call this. I know, I'm turning heel general manager. I'm so sorry. I don't know who the hell Gio- the, the only main reason I'm doing this is because I legit don't know who Joy is. I don't remember her. Um, so clearly she has an, an, a very impactful 
um, uh, 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 appearance on WWE. Apparently, she was very important to the roster. Uh, just like how I'm proving on um, Running Night Raw that she's important to my roster by showing the world who she is. She is going to be the Ryback of this series. <laughs> Give her squash match after squash. I don't know why I said Ryback. Ryback's a weird... I didn't mean to compare Ryback to George Giovanni. Like, maybe... I was gonna... Like, the idea was that the squash match... Jo sorry, the joke fell off. Forget it. Anyways. Women's title submission match. Tori Wilson, Stacey Gabler. Um, Kane versus Carlito. Rivalry in place of matchup. Um, Eddie with Ch Chava Guerrero versus Ric Flair with Randy Horton. A ladder. Uh, Rey Mysterio, Big Show, Muhammad Hassan, Triple Threat, Main Event Extravaganza. Number one contender, IC title. Merchandise sponsorship because money. Uh, tag team, not, uh, not a tag team match. A title match in a tables match for the Intercontinental Championship. A lot of T's in there versus Batista and Kane. <laughs> Too many T's. Then we have Tr Triple H and Kurt Angle. Backstage brawl. Okay. Ready. Uh, simulate. And, yep. Wow. Joy Giovanni losing in a handy. What? Psh what? How could she possibly lose that? She's like freaking Goldberg up in here. What the hell? Why is she, why did she lose that? I don't understand. I thought she was like the best female performer ever. Okay, I thought she was better than Becky Lynch, the man. I thought she was better than than Bret Hart, Stone Cold Steve Austin, The Rock, John Cena, Hulk Hogan, all of them combined. What the hell happened? Um. Anyway, she surprisingly, surprising to me, loses to Christy Hemi, Carlito, and Davari. Um, surprising to me, of course. Stacey Keebler, new women's champion in the submission match, defeats and taps out Tori Wilson. Interesting. Uh, Ric Flair with Randy... Evolution! Like, these two, Ric Flair and Randy Orton, they are unstoppable, apparently. You know, I'm trying to make Eddie and Chavo feel good. It's not happening. Ric Flair and Randy Orton's fucking destroying them. Um, but okay. And then Big Show, surprising the world. Uh, t t new Intercontinental Championship um, uh, contender. However, who is the Intercontinental Champion? Kane! Wow, Kane defeating Batista. Batista not, lo not looking too good right now because he just lost the Intercontinental title to Kane. Shocking developments. As Triple H defeats Kurt Angle on a backstage brawl. Okay. Triple H probably attacked him. That's probably what happened. Anyways, fan change. Raw! 70,000! Cool! That's a good first show for this episode! That's a good first episode for this episode. Yeah! It's probably not gonna continue. Um, low on cash. I know, it's okay. But I don't have to pay anybody yet. Okay, I already... I already know. Let's see the morale really quick. Uh, yeah, you guys you guys keep losing. I noticed. I'm trying to help you win, man. I'm trying to help him win. It's just not happening. Anyways, um... Uh, uh... Uh, uh what was I saying? Okay, so... Next ma next next show next show unless there's any other managerial duties I should know about no okay um so another thing that I noticed about Raw is that we have the first pay per view and it's really fast um I didn't mention this earlier but it's it's kind of a problem because like I can't long term book stuff and it's, it's bad it's bad for me anyways let's go to Raw it's promo uh, uh 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 rivalry in place of a match. Um, Chava Guerrero versus Randy Orton, because hopefully then, you know, you can get some popularity by not losing. Um, and then we have another rivalry in place of match with Kurt Angle Triple H, mainly because they've been fighting, you know, in the main event, you know, three times in a row. Um, however, the current Intercontinental Champion, as he just defeated Batista, let's see if he can defeat one of the men fighting for the WWE title at the next pay-per-view. The Challenger. Kurt Angle in a submission match. Let's see if he can defeat him in a submission. No, no, no. Not just any submission match because I'm booking on the fly here, ladies and gentlemen. In an ultimate submission match. That's right. 60 minute. 60 minute? 60 minute. Uh, 30 minutes. 30 minutes. We're gonna, we're gonna have Kurt, 30 minutes. Kurt Angle versus Kane. Okay, look at that. Look at that. Look at that popularity. The K's. Actually, Kurt's angle, that's K and then an A, and then Kane, just K, and then an A, and then N. Coincidence? Yes. Um, okay, triple threat match. Considering Tori Wilson 
just lost her her title. She wants, you know, some sort of revenge against her, against her opponent, Stacey Keebler. And yes, I know Joy Joy Ivani is there. We're not we're not done with her yet. So Stacey Keebler, okay, they're gonna fight fighting each other. However, Trish Stratus she wants to get involved in that women's title feud. So if she wins this triple threat match, she'll be inserted into another triple threat match at the next review of Backlash. Backlash. Yes. Um. Okay, we got that match next. Eddie versus Randy Orton. Ladies and gentlemen. No, wait, no. I, I, I bu I'm booking the wrong show. There we go. Eddie Guerrero versus... That's, that's not Randy. Randy Orton with Ric Flair. So hopefully Eddie, maybe by himself, he can defeat Randy... I doubt it. But maybe he can defeat Randy Orton. Hopefully. Um... So, so yeah, anyways, um, uh, uh, what next? Okay, so, Muhammad Hassan, and I guess Muhammad Hassan and the Big Show are fighting for the IC title? I guess? I guess that's the feud now? I guess Batista, now that he's lost the title, it's gonna be Muhammad Hassan versus Big Show? Actually, on second thought, that doesn't make any sense, because Big Show, he's just gonna be fighting... For the title, I don't know. This is this is horrible booking. However, B he's gonna Rey Mysterio. Muhammad Hassan's gonna be fighting Rey Mysterio. Shit, I completely messed up because I sort of have it, you know, kind of written out here on, you know, like I said last episode. Uh, the we have, I have two shows written out previously, and this kind of screwed over my second show. It's fine. Hopefully, it's fine. Okay, well, Kane is going to be fighting Big Show at the next pay-per-view, so we have that covered. We can have, you know what, you know what, no, that doesn't, that makes sense. Rey Mysterio, Big Show versus Muhammad Hassan for one final time. There we go, that's the, that's what I'm going to say. Anyways, Kane, since he has to be fighting, you know, the, the animal, not the animal, since Kane has to be fighting the world's largest athlete, the Big Show, at the next pay-per-view, you know, Batista... He's pissed off. He's angry. And Carlito, he doesn't have an opponent. So Carlito is going to be fighting Batista tonight in this matchup. I'm um, actually... We're gonna, can, we, can, we, can we switch those? Actually, can we... Can we just... Can we just... We're just going to switch the... Yeah, because least popularity. So Batista and Carlito. Boom! Now you might be wondering, what about Joy Giovanni? The greatest professional wrestler in the history of our sport how are you possibly gonna have her um fight well my dear viewers um we're gonna give her another another test we're gonna test the waters with joy giovanni once again um in, in another in, in another in another handicap match um so we're gonna have joy giovanni all by her all by her lonesome against against christy heavy Chavo Guerrero and Davari. Yeah. <laughs> sure. <laughs> so, I will admit, not as stacked as the last episode. Not as stacked as the last episode. Or the last part. The last show. You know, the first show in this in this episode. But I think this should be pretty good. Okay, let's just go through the matches now. Joy Giovanni versus Chavo Guerrero versus Davari. Well, sorry, George Giovanni versus Chavo Guerrero and Zavari and Christy Hemi. And, yep, Ch wow, Joy Giovanni, she is too- I don't know why she's doing so bad, but she's, she's not looking too good. Um, uh, Muhammad Hassan, however, defeats the Big Show. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, Batista defeats Carlito. Kind of obvious. Um, Randy Orton and Ric Flair once again defeats- Come on, Eddie, I'm trying to give you a chance here, and he's just- <sighs> Whatever. Triple threat. Tori Wilson defeats Stacey Keebler and Trish Stratus. The former champion, Tori Wilson. Interesting. And then Kane defeats Kurt Angle. Kane, the new Intercontinental Champion, defeating Kurt Angle, number one contender. Um, uh, do you want to continue without saving? Yes. Do you want to exit general management? No. I keep pushing the start button. Anyways, this is probably going to be a worse show. Yeah, fan change SmackDown. I didn't think it would be... That's good. 50,000? Okay. 
Okay, a great match enjoyed by all JBL. Don't care. Um, don't care. Okay, well, this is this, this, this sleeper match Kane, then Randy Orton as well. Expiring contract. Oh no, Joy Giovanni, what am I gonna do without you? Um, emails, contract expiring. Okay, in one week. I don't really care. Time to interfere. Stop, JBL. Okay. Okay, Eddie Guerrero, you lost two points? I thought you would only lose the one. Why'd you. You were at 70 before. Oh no, you were at 70. You know, when I started the episode, and then you lost twice. That makes that makes sense. Um, but yeah, next episode is going to be the Backlash pay-per-view. Now, what I'm going to do with that one, I might just book Backlash. Yeah, I'll just book Backlash. And then the episode following that, we're just going to, you know, go back to the two. If that makes, if that makes sense. I, I'm going to assume it makes sense. I don't know. You, you'll know by the next episode. I might change it up because, you know, it doesn't, it doesn't quite work out. I think. Yeah, because then it'll be this raw and then vengeance. We'll see. We'll see. Anyways, that's gonna have to be the end of this episode here, on our Smack numbers about 2006 general manager of the rivalries looking pretty good. Um. Yeah, that's that's gonna have to be it. That's my chair. Um, squeaky chair. Cool. Okay, we we that's that's gonna be the next episode. Backlash pay per view. Look forward to that. But yeah, that's gonna have to be the end of this episode here on our SmackDown vs. Raw 2006 General Manager mode. If you guys like to please me know by hitting the like button down below. Comment anything you want to comment. Subscribe if you haven't already. But if you have, why not hit the bell so be notified of everything we do here on the Bad Wrestling Channel. I'm of course Dominic, and have a good day from Bad Wrestling. Bye bye. Yo.